Ladies and gentlemen, Assalamu alaikum. We welcome you to the CGS promotion ceremony of class 8 for the session 2020-2021. A unique year of education has been accomplished at CGS. As students successfully completed an entire academic year virtually without any disruptions. We are proud to announce that the students of class 8 have been successfully promoted to grade 9 as they passed out with flying colors. Today, we appreciate their sincere efforts in these difficult times through the Middle School Promotion Ceremony 2020-2021. A'uzu billahi min ash-shaytani r-rajim Bismillahi r-Rahmani r-Rahim Alhamdulillahi rabbil alameen Ar-Rahmani r-Rahim Ma'lik yawm al-Din إياك نعبد وإياك نستعين إهدنا سواط المستقيم سواط الذين أنعمت عليهم غير المغضوب عليهم ولا الضالين آمين Dear class of 2021, you might not be getting a promotion like the other batches, but always remember you are part of a global community of students. Your hard work has not gone unnoticed. The lonely virtual classes spent studying still remains true. Right now, you might feel uncertain, sad at some point. But have faith, COVID-19 will not be able to stand in the way of your hopes and dreams. Things will improve and you know that it has already started to improve. I encourage you to concentrate on your good times. I encourage you to focus on your accomplishment. I encourage you to still believe in your present life. Have courage and please move forward to go for the next step. Dear students, your future is promising and your hard work is not and never going to be unnoticed. Now go and celebrate and use your gifts and talents in this world to make the impossibles possible. All the best for a wonderful future.
urban today is plagued with dangers. Coronavirus, earthquake, climate change, and global warming. But despite all the odds, we still have managed to graduate after a year of online learning. Hello, I'm Shuverno, and I'll never forget the first time I came to middle school as a student. Back then, I was an enthusiastic toddler, but now I'm a prepared preteen, ready for a new chapter of upper school to unfold. As Charles Dickens put it, it was the best of times, it was the worst of times. We finally managed to finish middle school, and what I take are the good and bad memories that turns into experience. I express my gratitude to all of my middle school teachers for making this adventure noteworthy. To Ferdos Smith, thank you for making your classes enjoyable. Your liveliness is exactly why I remember everything you taught us to this day. And to all of my CGS25 batchmates, let's buckle up for an unforgettable experience of our high school lives. Thank you. A very good afternoon to all my honorable teachers and my fellow classmates. I am Nabunita Dash, and today I feel lucky enough to get a chance to speak and tell all our memories about middle school. Well, if I was asked to describe all our memories of middle school in one word, then it would be unprecedented. This whole year has been a roller coaster ride for all of us, starting from the long week of quarantines, then online classes, then attending our exams online, then giving virtual uh, online exams, then also attending virtual uh, holidays online, then doing uh, ACP and annual athletics online. This year, we made many memories that we are going to cherish for the rest of our lives. I can confidently say that this year was quite a lot special. We all have overcome difficulties that our parents, grandparents, or even our generation before didn't. We had overcome many difficulties with the help of our teachers. This journey would be impossible without them. I would like to appreciate all the hard work and efforts of our teachers, coordinators, and counselors. Standing here at this moment, I really miss Ashwak sir. The sad moment of middle school was when Ashwak sir passed away. All in all, I have garnered a lot of experiences in middle school, experiences that I would not have gathered anywhere else. I reckon all these memories will stay with me throughout my entire life. Thank you. Hello everyone. My name is Osneef and today I'm going to share some experiences from the school that gave me so many memories called middle school. I still remember the first day of middle school. It seems like it was only yesterday that we were skinny little third graders fighting to sit beside our friends. And yet, here we are, saying our goodbyes to the school that gave us so many memories. I remember looking at my upperclassmen and thinking how they tackled everything that was around them. And yet now we are the upperclassmen tackling the same problems they did with the help of our teachers. The more I went up the ladder of classes, the more I realized the selfless love that I was showered by my teachers. It seemed only wonderful that they were there and they helped us guide us through everything we, we, we found from the problems of being failing in class or maybe just feeling this down or demotivated. They were the ones that guided me through the correct path and became my torch when things got dark. They made me the person I am today. I still remember of the days when literature was the hardest subject I had ever known and my, me and my friends' ever-ending desire to become teenagers was like a never-ending fire. This fire only seemed to grow when we saw our seniors do all the new things in school and couldn't wait to start RS, MUNs and sports tournaments. My friends were the ones who carried me to victory. We fought, we made up and fought again. It was a never-ending cycle. They were the ones who, who stood by my side and acted as a pillar for me, connected by all the bonds we shared that even a pandemic could not uproot. And we all can say this truly, that we will not forget the memories of middle school. Hi everyone, I'm Sreshta, a student of grade 8. The six years journey of the middle school is finally coming to an end. It has been an adventurous journey for me. It's unforgettable for me actually. I have had numerous ups and downs, but the memories I had in between are to be forever remembered. Through this journey, I have had some wonderful teachers who have shaped me and made me who I am today. I'm really thankful for them. Our teachers were not only teachers, they were our friends, they were our guide. 
and I'm so thankful to have them by my side. Each and every person who has been a part of my journey over the six years have shaped me and made me who I am today. For that, I'm forever grateful to each and every one of you. My friends, my teachers, my admins and the lower staff, of course. I even had the wonderful experience of traveling to Australia along with my friends and teachers when I was only in grade 8. It was actually a surreal experience for me. One of my fondest memories has to be the visit to the community school we had last year. I wish we had the opportunity of visiting it once again, but the pandemic wouldn't allow. Now talking about the pandemic, it has changed a lot in our lives. But our school authorities and teachers left no stone unturned to get us back to the normal life. Our no online classes started from March last year and now it's over a year we have been having our classes virtually. I want to say thank you to each and every one of you who has been a part of my journey. I'm really grateful to have you all by my side and I'm sure that none of us expected the end of our school life to be this way when we were the senior most batch of middle school. But nonetheless, we have come to the end of a wonderful journey in the middle school and I wish you a very good luck for your upcoming years in the upper school and ahead. Thank you. Life under lockdown feels like being adrift in the ocean where we're desperate for any sign of land, yet nothing but an uncomfortable vastness looms. This vastness is uncertain to itself, where there is precious little certainty to go around these days. We can feel a bit un unmotivated. We must go on and we must attempt to clear this haze of discomfort in our own ways. Some of us may uh, isolate further as sadness seeps in, while others may keep digging into, the into our assignments with great gusto. Now that school is coming to an end, there is a lot of boredom. Most of us cross days out of our calendars waiting for this day to arrive, and now that it is here, I am sorry it is. We are going to miss a lot of our mentors who have shaped our lives impermeably into what it is today. Although things going forward will change, most of us are waiting for it to resemble like, uh, the world like it was before quarantine. I am very proud of us for uh, being able to educate ourselves through uh, being able to educate ourselves uh, for a whole year through online classes. This obviously wouldn't have been possible without the help of our phenomenal teachers. They were with us during the days when the class was filled with um, active participation and even during the time when it was deadly silent with everyone's cameras off. We will obviously graduate again in senior year. I'm, hope I'm looking forward to that and I'm very excited for upper school. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, Assalamu Alaikum. A very good evening to you all. It gives me immense pleasure to deliver the vote of thanks for the Class 8 Promotion Ceremony 2020-21. I, Mezabin Chaudhary, the coordinator of Class 8, would like to thank our Honorable Directors, Mrs. Farhat Khan and Mrs. Ispahani for their non-stop support and innovative way of direction. I would like to thank Mr. Hector Fernandez, the head of middle school, 
for his guidance and excellent leadership throughout this turbulent academic year. Thanks to our beloved counselor, Mrs. Mezubin Aziz, for her endless support to our students and teachers. Thanks to our admin for their non-stop support to run class 8 virtually. I want to specially thank all the class 8 teachers for their sincerity throughout the pandemic to educate our students and also to be a strong support to the students as a champion. I must thank our students for showing resilience in such difficult times and coming out successful. And last but not least, I want to thank all the parents for being extremely supportive to their children and the school, which has resulted in a successful academic year online. I end by thanking everyone who watched the ceremony and made this event a grand success. Thank you. Good evening. Thank you.